Hello, my name is Colin Moore and I'm the Director of Planning and Construction for Winston-Salem Forsyth County Schools. I'm here today to talk to you about the construction and renovation at Philo Hill Magnet Academy. The Philo Hill renovation was approved by the voters of Forsyth County in 2016. The new facility will have a core capacity of 800 students with a potential for 550 or 800 students to occupy the facility at opening. There is a renovation of the existing administrative gymnasium and dining buildings that will occur as part of this project. There will be construction of a new dining and media areas on the main level and a new three-story classroom wing constructed adjacent to the existing gymnasium. Construction of the addition is slated to begin in the spring of 2021. There are currently two proposals under consideration for students at Philo Hill. A relocation of students for the 2021-2022 school year will result in no renovations of the existing building with students on campus. The addition and renovations will complete by July of 2022 and students would occupy the building before the beginning of the 2022-2023 school year. If there is no relocation of students during construction, the existing building renovations will occur with students on campus. The addition and renovations would complete in February of 2023 and students would occupy the building during the 2022-2023 school year. You can see on this screen a proposed site schematic plan for the new facility. The existing admin gymnasium area is located in white and the addition containing the dining areas and the classroom wings and the media area are located in the red. In this slide you can see the proposed schematic floor plan for the new facility. The three-story classroom wing would be located in the rear with the administrative, media, and gymnasium areas in the middle of the screen and the specials and CTE areas on the right side. This screen shows the proposed rendering elevations for the new facility. The top rendering indicates the front of the building looking from the Philo Hill parking lot, and the lower rendering is a view of the rear of the building looking from the playfields. That concludes my presentation on the construction at Philo Hill Magnet Academy. At this time, we will turn it over to the Student Assignment Department. Hello, my name is Homan Atashbar and I'm the Director of Student Assignment. I'm here to talk to you today about the middle school redistricting for Philo Hill Middle School. Philo Hill is going to be under construction next year and is to be completed uh, in 2022. So we are proposing to reopen Philo Hill as a uh, state-of-the-art arts magnet school. The assignment changes for Philo Hill, uh, it'll be closed for next year for the 21-22 school year. And a newly constructed school will open in the same location at Philo Hill Middle School in 22-23. It'll be an arts magnet with a residential area and so we can accommodate for magnet population countywide. So students currently attending and residential uh, to the boundaries that I'll show you in, in a second will be assigned to Winston-Salem Preparatory Academy and Haynes on the Hill site uh, for the 21-22 school year. And students will have the option to choose between their zones of um, schools in their zones of Flat Rock Middle School, Clemens Middle School, and Winston-Salem Preparatory Academy in the Southwest Green Zone uh, between February 8th and February 26th. So, in, on this uh, map, you'll see um, two scenarios, one for the school year of 21-22 and one for the school year of 22-23 after the uh, construction has been completed and the school has been reopened. Um, students in the green area that you see on the map uh, will be going to Winston-Salem Preparatory Academy for the 21-22 school year. And students in the blue part on the map will uh, be going to Haynes Middle School or you know these are students that are living around that uh, middle school right now so they'll be residential to Haynes Middle School. For the 22-23 school year uh, students in that blue area will still be attending Haynes Middle School. The students in the green area now will have an area around Philo Hill uh, as a new school and that will be a, sort of a, this is our proposed 
um, area right now for um, reducing the residential students for Philo Hill to allow for that magnet population to come in. Um, again, this is proposed and there will be some adjustments made to that as the magnet programming is coming together. All right, so these are just uh, some of the demographic data for um, the school closure for Philo Hill. Um, as you can see, there's not a lot of changes um, in the demographics for those schools. How does this all work with our choice timeline? So on December 5th, we'll have a school showcase. On January 14th, we'll um, meet with our choice committee, board attorney, executive cabinet, and our contractors out of NC State, ORED, that helped us with this redistricting to assess the community feedback. On January 26th, we'll take the full presentation back to the board and ask them for call to action to finalize the middle school redistricting for Philo Hill. And then on fact, between parents can apply to schools uh, with choice and magnet between February 8th and February 26th. And this concludes our middle school redistricting for Philo Hill presentation. Thank you.